Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. Stay tuned. We'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. Hello and welcome to the Lusail Stadium, just about 10 miles to the north of Doha here in Qatar. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and delighted to be joined as always by Stuart Robson. And both teams looking to get off to a flying start here on match day one for them at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. It's France against Denmark. Well, I'm looking forward to this one, Derek. It's so important that you get off to a good start. So let's hope both sides go for the win here and we get an exciting match. Here's the side France will go with. Hugo Lloris begins in goal. Rafael Varane plays with Dayo Upamecano in central defence. And in attack today, Kylian Mbappe starts with Karim Benzema. And the starting lineup for Denmark. Kasper Schmeichel begins in goal. Andreas Christensen starts alongside Simon Kerr in central defence. Pierre Emil Hoybier plays alongside Christian Eriksen in the centre of midfield. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. And now they get the ball rolling. Delaney. Mikael Damsgaard. Well, he could really get at the opposition. Delaney. Eriksson! Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. take this on well the shot looked promising but the keeper had the measure of it will France be a hit or a miss what do I mean by that well when they won in 1998 everything was rosy in the camp but they were dumped out in the group stage what a chance this is Derek oh good reflexes from the keeper and the danger averted Kick taken by Christian Eriksen. And a time for calm on the ball. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. An exciting talent who has everything a forward needs to be successful. Stewart, what are you expecting? Real chance! There it is! A delightful start to this match. Just what they were hoping for. Well, as the replay shows, this is all about his ability to find space in the box, which then makes the finish look so much easier. That's good play from him. Goal! 
One nil then. For Denmark, number eight, Thomas Delaney. Hernandez. And they know they need to stop him. And let's give credit to the defending. Kasper Dolberg. And slipped through beautifully. Must be. And he's such a highly respected goalkeeper, Hugo Lloris. And over from Ericsson. Could be. And it goes. That will greatly help the cause. Now they only need to keep concentration levels high. Well, here's the goal again. And it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance, and he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. Goal. So underway once more, 2-0 the lead here. Pavard. Mbappe with it. Benzema. Oh, he's gone for goal. Well, after that attempt, gobbled up by the keeper. An inability to keep hold of the ball there. And making headway. Firing is in. Well, good effort, but he's placed it wide. Well, the keeper asking too much of his teammates on this occasion. Throw in to come. And intercepted it. Benzema. Karim Benzema and very deftly cut out Javier Skolba Olsen here is Vass throw in for Denmark Will it be? And it goes! A three-goal cushion, and you truly sense it's a matter of how many. Well, it's a very simple finish in the end, but his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most. Well, you've got to say, an incredible first-half performance. That scoreline tells you all you need to know. Griezmann. And Pavard on the ball. And the referee spotted the foul, but has played advantage. Well, finally, the whistle had to be sounded. 
Stoppage in play and a chance for the referee to go back and retrospectively hand out a yellow card. Pavar. Retaining possession proving difficult. This might be ideal for the counter. Can they take advantage of the situation? Gives it a go! A goal! And I'll tell you what, on this sort of form, very few would lay a glove on them. Well, just look at his strength here. He holds off the challenge, he keeps his balance, and he finds the back of the net. It's a wonderful goal. And this is turning into something of a rout. 4-0. Oh, and that challenge carried with it quite the element of risk. Now, what's the referee going to do next? And there it is, a red card, and everything was going mostly to plan. Well, it shouldn't affect the result, but it ruins what has been a very good performance. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Griezmann. And no worries for the goalkeeper. Good situation for Griezmann. Well, he's given it away. Benzema. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Well, there's a sound reason why we're focusing on him. He's making his presence felt in attack, Stuart. Well, what can you say about him today? He's been a real live wire. Full of tricks, great feet and good goals as well. Top stuff. And they kick off here. So off and running again, and there was a real gulf in class in the first 45. Will we see an improved effort? From... There could be trouble here. He's already been cautioned. And it is a second book about offence. That's the end of the story for him. And it doesn't surprise me, Derek. He's played on the edge today. And the substitution will occur now. Keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. They take it short. And that is how to block. Well, that's gone out. And it is going to be a goal kick. Difficult to stop him. Griezmann. And with that, the attack fizzles out. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Well, 
Well, it fizzled out. Corner kick forthcoming. So a personnel change then. Favouring the short one. What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. Mbappe with it. Decent progress with the ball at his feet. And a goal kick it'll be. Too much height on the shot. And a substitution in the offing. Benjamin Pavard entering the match. Number 22, Theo Hernandez. Ericsson on the ball Jensen nail it and he read it well intercepting it 30 minutes left for play crossed into the penalty area And that was a very fine read. Rabio. Benzema. No space for them here. But quick thinking defensively. Ericsson. Terrific block. Possession changing hands. Jensen. Lovely ball over the top. He had to react and did. Jensen. And slipped through beautifully. Well, deemed to be offside by the merest of margins. Well, it's very close to being the perfectly timed run. But whether it's an inch or a yard, he's still offside. Well, deemed to have been a cautionable offence. Well, no question about it. He deserved his book in there. And time for the change now. Number 20, Kingsley Coleman. Aurelien Chouameni. Effective challenge. But he could run onto it here. What a big chance that was. Keeper has the ball. Teo Hernandez. Here's Mbappe. Making progress is Kylian Mbappe. Will it be? And the keeper throws himself up the ball. And over comes the corner. Well, not the best clearance. Mbappe.
And the cross smuggled away. Not a touch off the defender last of all, so a corner. Well, they fancy a short one. Delivered into the box. Clears it away. And they have possession again. Rafael Varan. Chouameni. This is Varan. And a strong tackle. A message delivered from the referee to the fourth official. Three minutes on the board. Jesper Lindström. Oh, he's given the ball away. There goes the final whistle. And it's a bad news story from a French point of view. Defeat here. Stuart, something's up for us. And they kick off here. Oh, good reflexes from the keeper and the danger averted. Real chance. There it is. A delightful start to this match. Just what they were hoping for. Must be. Oh, he's such a highly respected goalkeeper, Hugo Lloris. Could be. In it goes. That will greatly help the cause. Now they only need to keep concentration and making headway. Firing it in. Well, good effort, but he's placed it wide. Ericsson. In it goes! A three-goal cushion, and you truly sense it's a matter of how many. Can they take advantage of the situation? A goal! And I'll tell you what, on this sort of form, very few would lay a glove on them. And there it is, a red card, and everything was going mostly to plan. And it is a second book about offence. That's the end of the story for him. And it doesn't surprise me. Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. See some progress with the ball at his feet. And a goal kick it'll be. Too much height on the shot. And a substitution in the offing. And the keeper throws himself at the ball. 